Moving on now to the morning business report. More people are working longer days during the pandemic. But how is that affecting productivity? Channel 3's Jane King joins us live in New York to break that down. Good morning, Jane. Uh, hi, Nicole and Wendell. Good morning to you. So, well, the workday grew almost 80 minutes longer last year, but workers were 200% more productive. So this comes from ProtoScore. They said the typical white-collar workday during the pandemic averaged from 7.46 a.m. to 6.12 p.m. Well, the Federal Reserve will meet today and tomorrow and will have to find a balance between an improving economy in some ways, but parts of it that are still very weak. No change in interest rates is expected. The Fed may talk Talk about things that they perhaps see coming down the road, like inflation, the uh, dramatic rise of prices. And Toys R Us has a new owner. WHP Global has acquired a controlling interest in True Kids. That is the parent company of Toys R Us and Babies R Us. And it does plan to open a number of Toys R Us stores again in the U.S. ahead of the holiday season. Well, the Dow and S&P 500 hit new highs yesterday. The reopening stocks, like airlines, were especially strong. Today looks a little bit lower, down about 40 points as we await that Fed meeting. Live from New York, I'm Jane King. Back to you.